wait a minute. Uh, now, let me tell you honor, something. Should I refer to you as your honor? Excuse me. If anybody mad at this sketch, I want you to contact Ralph the makeup man <laughs> who gave me these oversized lips. <laughs> Now, what is this? Well, what would you like to say to black people? Never mind the black people. To all you people out there, you see this positive article we got from the New York Post? Well, you can be sure next week's article will not be this positive. Excuse me, but that is not you in that photograph. Let me tell you something. We're going to be in trouble with the NAANP, the ECOC, and the EIEIO. That's right now. Look well, here. Well, you're, you're changing your image. You want to relate to black. I want to relate to the black people. Tell them not to fear me on the Supreme Court justice. Now, look here, sunshine. I can't even understand what you're saying. I say, look here, sunshine. A lot of people worry. My name is Robin. Well, yes, I know that. Now, you, you, you talk about this here abortion nonsense. Uh, I don't want to talk about that issue. You don't want to tell us your stand no, on No, I will not. I'm going to remain silent on that now. But I will talk to you about the cannabis. The cannabis? Yeah, that's right. You did smoke marijuana. The cannabis helped my self-confidence. What do you mean? Well, I just love to smoke reefer. Pop. What? Now, now, wait a minute. You're not going to light that on these airways. Hey, I, I admit to it. I smoke a joint now and then. <laughs> You don't think this is going to hurt your chances with the nominating committee? I know I'm getting high, because it's starting to look like a real TV studio. <laughs> hey, baby, we need some music, I tell you that. Oh, dear. Do you really think you have to go this far? You live for a second, Ruby Tooth. <laughs> I'll turn that off there. I'm going to tell you the truth now. What do you think you're proving by doing this? I'm going to tell you something right now, sweetness. Yes. My little ruby tooth. <laughs> I make my best decisions when I smoke my bong. Really? Now, for example, let me show you. All right, you're going to smoke the bong and make a decision. All right. All right, now, here come a, here come a decision. Yes. No abortion. Oh. That's right. That's how you came up with your stand on abortion. Hey, who painted this face? Oh, Shab? <laughs> By the way, Your Honor, I didn't realize it, but you have blue eyes. I knew I was smoking too much of this. <laughs> you notice when I smoke, my hair go up? <laughs> I'm really getting wasted, I'll tell you that. I'll tell you did that. <laughs> I tell you that, though, but you got nothing to be afraid You're of. You're not going to talk about this kind of drug use when you meet the Senate committee. No, I know. I keep that cool when I meet them. <laughs> now, I must tell you that I have a white wife. I must be very honest. Your wife is white? I'd like you to meet my wife right now. She's so beautiful. This is my wife, Fresca. Fresca? That's right. How you doing there, darling? Hey, um, it's so good you to there. see you, sweetness. Good to see you. Mm -hmm. Oh, those lips, those lips. <laughs> My wife's Hello. name is... Well, hello, Mrs. Thomas. Ma Ms. That's... Every time we go to the airport together, they fresh come. <laughs> hello, my little snooper doop. You want to climb under this here robe and kiss your husband? Oh, dear. Sounds a lot like Howard Stern, you know? <laughs> I, want, I want you to smoke this till you're paralyzed. <laughs> hey, right. what? I, I left her home. Let me just stare at the collection of sweat between your cleavage. Oh, dear. Mm. You know, how, how can you possibly see any cleavage, Robin? Tell I'll me. be honest with you. He's smoking a lot of pot. Let so. me tell you something. You smell real nice, and I'm going to be honest with you. This really ain't my wife. This here is Audrey Lander. Ah. Now... Where is your wife? My wife is out the door. She didn't want to be part of this show. <laughs> now, let me ask you a question, Audrey. Yes. You used to be on that late nighttime soup opera, Houston. <laughs> Is that correct? Yeah, that's kind of close. Dallas. Dallas, that's a, boy, this here joint is annoying, isn't it? <laughs> oh, man. Now, how is it being a big movie star? I don't know yet. <laughs> Please, no, seriously, you know you're a big star. How is it to be, I tell you, I'm too stoned to do this interview. You interview me. Okay. Go ahead, I'll tell you that. I'm just going to lay here and drink you in. <laughs> now, let me ask you something, the longer we're talking. You look like a sweet girl. Now, you against abortion, right? Are we supposed to, like, tell real opinions no, here? Yeah, no, yeah, because no. I, you, you are against it, right? You're doing a celebrity interview? Yeah. Your Honor? Well, I understand oh, you're a religious no, girl. I am a religious girl. Yes. And you don't... I believe in God. And you don't date, right? What's your story? I'm married. I can't date. Yeah, I'm <laughs> <that's> against <laughs> her husband's wishes. I Let me ask you this, then. Do you date a black man? 
Would I? I'll tell you something. <laughs> I wasn't married. You know? I want to make things better for the black man in this country, starting with me. <laughs> I don't see nothing wrong with that. Don't you think that's a little selfish? Robin, how, how soon are we going to hear from the NAACP on this? <laughs> I think they're on the phone now. Don't you hear a phone ringing? I'll tell you that. Listen, when we come back, we talk to Audrey. Okay. I'll get out of some makeup. That's makeup? Yeah, this is makeup. I'll try and get out of this makeup. You're not a black man. Oh, man. John, I really love those lips. You, you are know? so cute. I can't believe it. I cannot <laughs> so believe you. how cute so are you are. You. Oh, man. When we come back, can we just make out on this couch for a good hour? I love Maybe. this woman. When we come back, Judy, Bro uh, Judy, I mean, Audrey, Bro <laughs> You are Where is your sister, Judy? Uh, how can we never bring your sister, Judy, with you? I think she'd be scared. Your hair just took a, a trip. Uh, yeah, I got sort of that Lyle Alzado thing happening. I didn't want to. I didn't want to scare anybody. I'll be honest with you. What the heck is this? All right, listen. Everybody, stay here. Judd Nelson is here tonight. It's going to be awesome. Jenny Terrio's big comeback. Stutter and John talk to a lot of celebrities, and the great Audrey Landers is here. Yeah. The Cosby Show. Yeah. What you want? People seem to like when I pull my makeup off, you know, right in front of you. Audrey's so cute, man. It reminds me of Mission Impossible when yeah. you do this. Here he goes. You mean to tell me Larry? Oh my God. Larry Hagman. Oh, oh goodness. Larry Hagman never hit on you on the set of. Uh, hey, oh, your yeah. oh, eyebrows are gonna come off. Gonna I don't know if I can take this off. This is kind of stuck. Yeah, it's, it's all stuck oh, in your hair. God. Oh. Oh man. Oh, maybe, I hate this. Maybe you're stuck being black. No more characters. You know what? I think I'm stuck being black. It's hard enough being Howard Stern. Now this is a real nightmare. What's the Talk name? about discrimination. What's the name of that movie? Jungle Fever. I can't believe it. W.O.R. just cut my pay by 20%. <laughs> Unbelievable. There is discrimination. Hey, look at what we found in the hall here at Channel 9. Look at this idiot. <laughs> hey. At least you're not him. Yeah. I'd rather, I'd rather be stuck in this makeup for the rest of my life than be this guy. <laughs> hey, Johnny B's on the loose, all right? He sure is. He's so on the loose, now he has no TV show. <laughs> hey, look what I also found, Audrey. How about the movie. Oh, Jungle Fever. How about that, you and me? <laughs> you know, we are. Right before I was coming over here, I was watching uh, Cable, and they were showing you on Chorus Line. Yeah? Yeah, you're in that movie. I don't yeah. know if you know that or not. I didn't know it was just, I didn't know it was just on. When you were on that, uh, when you were on that uh, show, Dallas? Yes. JR never hit on you at all? No. You're so good looking, man. How do you stay in such shape? I work at it. Oh, I you... dance a lot. Hey, Audrey, I gotta ask you, what are you I doing here anyway? Aren't you a little, aren't you too big a star to be here anyway? No, I missed you, Howard, since we did the radio show. I haven't talked to you, so I wanted to see you again. And what have you been doing since I last saw you? Um, I did a new movie. You did with who? Yeah, with Sherry Orbach and Tyrone Power Jr. Called really? California Casanova. Uh -huh. Oh my God, there it oh goes. My. Yeah. I don't know if I can watch it. Gotta, but but you can keep talking. <laughs> and what do we have? A clip from this movie? Yes, we do. I'm, I'm singing in it, and I wrote the song. Now this is going to be frightening. I think he's got it yeah. off. Wait till you see hey, it's, this. it's coming off. Let me see. Let me, <laughs> let me see a clip of you singing. I want to see that. Okay. Where is that? All right. Oh, Howard. I didn't give you any rhythm. Oh, man. You know, I really could have used you as one of my backup singers, you know? I can't believe it. Can you come on tour with me next? <laughs> I wish I could get this off. Face. It's stuck on his nose. I wish I could just kiss oh, you a lot. close your eyes. Close your eyes. All right. Yank it. There. Oh. Oh, how do I look now, oh. huh? Put it back. Put it back. Oh. I think if my eyelashes came off. I think so. I don't even like doing that stuff. <laughs> Oh, oh, now it's hair. now it's oh. <laughs> I kind of miss those lips.
it, you know? So who's this guy you're married to? What do you do? What do you, I mean, seriously, what I mean, you know, like, who's this guy, a rich guy? Didn't we learn it was a rich guy? I well, think you kept so saying that. Guy. He lived, actually, he lives in New York, New Jersey, and I live in L.A., so, uh... You never see him? We see each other on airplanes. And, uh, and how often do you see him? Like, once a month? You know, we see each other every week or so. You do? Mm-hmm. Do I look hideous with this stuff on? Well, yeah. I would like to look attractive to you. of it, you know, but you look very handsome. I swear to God, if I was your husband, I would worship you. That's all I know. Why won't I would you move to Los Angeles? His business is here. Let me tell you something. I don't know how, what important business mm -hmm. that is, but I would just, like, I, I would make love to you constantly. <laughs> I would worship you. I would kiss. May I kiss your feet? <laughs> I swear to God, would that, I would be like this all day if I was married <laughs> to you. I would be. <laughs> You're really in love. It's enough, Howard. It's enough. Foot worship, I would practice on you. I would get really jealous of that. And you know? this video that we saw that was just fancy, too. Yes. That's going to be on MTV? Actually, no, that's part of the film, California Casanova. And where can it's, I see this film? It's being released on video August 1st. Well, Robin, we have to go see that. We have to go to the video store. You have to get yeah, I'll come over your house and we'll watch it. <laughs> and how come this isn't in the movies? Because it was a video release here and it was theatrical all through Europe. Well, you see? They need to be pro-really one.